Hello. Okay, today we're focusing on how to get that flat stomach for summer and toned arms. So I know, at least for where I am, it's winter time, it's cold, it's like 20 something degrees out, but it is not too early to think about summer. February 1st is two days away. We need to get on the ball. So if you're looking to get more toned in the belly and you're looking to get, tone up your arms, I'm going to show you some moves that will help. Now I want to you know, give you the disclosure, unlike the magazines will tell you, you can't just do these exercises and see the magic happen. You have to eat and, you know, support your, your um, progress with a healthy diet and, you know, do other things. But for the most part, once you're doing a combination of cardio and eating well, strength training is such an important part. So let's get started. So we're going to show you some moves you can do. You can follow along or you can think about it for later. Here we go. I'm going to be using my BOSU. You don't need to use a BOSU. You can use just your hands on the floor. You can use um, a mat. You can use a ball. Anything you want. We're going to start with some um, cross climbers here with bringing the knee to the elbow. Okay. You can do this with your hands on the floor or against the wall or a step right here. So we're getting that cardio heart rate up but we're tweaking into the abs as well. You want to push yourself as hard as you can. are doing exercises that support strengthening the belly and the arms in preparation for summertime. Now, if you don't eat correctly along with it, that's not going to help you. We're going to jump in and out. So if you're going to jump out here, and then you're going to jump, your feet come here and jump here. You can do this on the floor without a BOSU. The BOSU just creates an unstable environment causing my core to work a little harder. Good. Okay, I'm flipping the BOSU over. If you don't have a BOSU, don't worry about it. You don't need one. You're going to take your butt on the floor here. Take a heavier weight, and we're going to go for reps. So what you're going to do right here, and we're going to do reps. You're going to take your heavier weight. You're going to bring it right to your forehead and up. Skull crushers. We're going to do one, two. Just bending and straightening the elbows. Three, four, five, six. Keep your butt up to engage the core. Seven, eight, nine. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Now we're going to pulse. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Good. You're going to take it over your head. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, you're going to pulse. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Excellent. Put that weight down. If you have a ball or a bosa, you're going to reach up onto it. If you have the floor, you're going to do roll-ups or crunches. So we're going to take one leg out right here, and we're going to kick up as we crunch up for 1, 2, Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 
switch one now if you're doing this with a ball obviously you have to hold down your hand down three four or you would do this without kicking your leg up six seven you can do this on the floor eight you can do roll-ups with bed time 10 11 12 13 14 15 16 17 18 19 20 you're going to turn on your side so if you're lying on the floor on your side you can do side leg lifts where you're lifting one or both of the legs up if you're doing it on the bow suit you're going to adjust or on a ball you're going to go onto your side here and we're going to go up two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen seventeen eighteen nineteen twenty lift the leg up one two turn and flex it three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen seventeen eighteen nineteen twenty switch sides now there's a lot of videos out there of people doing all these crazy exercises you know um to get you know promoting you know okay arms abs whatever the problem is, is the average person cannot do those exercises they're just too insane so hopefully one this is doable for you three like i said you can do this on the floor four five lifting the legs up six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen seventeen eighteen nineteen twenty twenty one twenty two twenty three or no, i did twenty right twenty one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen seventeen eighteen nineteen 20. Good. Now, you're going to lay flat on the floor. And if you're on the floor, you're not going to come up very far. If you're on a bow suit or a ball, you're going to come up further. You can reach your arms out. You can put your arms here. You can cross your arms over your head. It does, or over your chest. It doesn't matter. Kind of one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Can you do more? Yes, you may do more. You may do as many as you want. It doesn't matter to me. Okay, you're going to go into tricep push-ups if you can. If not, you're going to go into our next exercise, which is kickbacks. So if you're going to try some push-ups, you can stay on your knees here. You can go on your toes. You don't have to use a boat, so you can use the floor. Um, you can use a wall. Um, you just want to keep your hands together, and you're going to drop down. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Good. Next exercise, tricep kickbacks. Okay. Um, let me bend over here. You're going to bend over and you're going to kick your arms back like this. One, two. You can do this standing on a boat suit. Two, three. I'll just be adding the shot. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Don't swing. Ten. Fully extend and bend. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Okay, yes, you can do more. That's fine. I'll just change the camera, move the camera up a little bit. Thank you. Okay, 
take the arms back here, right back here, press it back. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. To the side here. Hand here, reaching over one. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. You want to make sure weight is challenging. Ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. Switch. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, thanks for the love, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, okay? Now, going down to the floor, let's finish up here, I'm going to go down, sorry, to the floor, right here. You're going to hold right here, or you can put this leg down if you need to. You're going to twist towards your knee. You're going to pulse it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, thirty, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine, thirty, thirty-one, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six. 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50. Switch. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50. Leg up, pull the belly in. 1, 2, 3, 4. If you can, reach to your toes. 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, and 50. Flip over to plank. <coughs> my bosu is here. I'm my bosu. Ready? Here we go. Now let's have a chat. All right. So what you want to do is, it's true, you cannot spot train. You can't just do these exercises and expect to see toned arms and a toned flat stomach, um, you know, by the summertime. What you need to do is, you need to do a full body strength training routine. Why didn't I focus on biceps? Because half the things you're going to do with your arms, I'm going to guess a lot of you will be doing chest presses and push-ups and things like that. They target your biceps anyway. So I'm targeting, I'm focusing on triceps, and I'm focusing on abdominal strengthening exercises. So once you eat well and you exercise correctly by doing some cardio and some strength training for your full body, and you start to melt the fat away, what's going to be left are, are the muscles that you've built these beautiful muscles that have, you know, been waiting to shine. As the fat melts off, there they are, ready to go. So that's what you want to focus on. Yes, it's true. You cannot spot train. However, you can strengthen and build muscle in certain areas while you are burning fat from the rest of your body. You can't choose where the fat comes off of. It just goes away in places it wants to go away in the order it wants to go away. And nobody, no two people are alike. 
but once it goes away, you want to have these beautiful muscles waiting for you on the other side, okay? So in a few months, if you practice these exercises, and you'll see, there's, of course, there's thousands out there that you can do. Tons of exercises. I picked a few that are very doable for anyone. I don't want you to walk into a fitness, you know, video and say, that looks ridiculous. I cannot do that. You probably can. You just need to step up, you know, take it back a little bit. So we're going to start basic and build from there. And you can come down. So I hope that this is helpful. I hope that you do incorporate these exercises into your workout routine. If you do them religiously, you will build muscle. And once you, you know, burn some of that extra winter um, hibernation fat off, you'll be ready to go. Thank you so much for joining me, and I hope that you follow me on YouTube, and uh, you can follow me on Periscope at Jana Heath. No gym, no excuses. I'll see you next time.